Welcome to Solime TV's Unboxing Farmega 40. I am Wim Decourt, and in this video, I talk about the much improved network resilience in Farmega 40. What is network resilience? It basically is how well the connection between Farmega Pro and Farmega Server can survive a network interruption. So let's dive right into a demo. What we have here is a file hosted on Farmega Server 14 and open in both Farmega 14 and Farmega 13. Let's go ahead and disconnect the network connection. I just have my Wi-Fi going on and I've just turned it off. So if we now try to do something in either file, at some point FileMaker Pro will realize that the network connection is no longer there and something will happen. And there we have it. Just as we expected, FileMaker Pro 13 has figured out that the network connection is gone and it says the communication with the host was interrupted and could not be re-established and it'll go ahead and close all of the FileMaker files. And that's what we expect from FileMaker 13. If we click OK, the window will go away and your FileMaker file is closed. But look at what FileMaker 14 has made of that. It realized that the communication with the host was interrupted, but it gives us the option to reconnect. We're still not connected to the network anymore. So if I go ahead and reconnect and just wait for my connection to reestablish itself, I can now just simply click reconnect and I can keep working in the file. That obviously is an enormous improvement. There are some caveats, of course. What if you have a running script like this one? If we go and have a look at my scripts, I have a script that will loop and pause for one second and move on to create new records in that loop. If I go ahead and run this script, and we can see it is creating new records. So if I go ahead and cut my network connection again, it will take a while for FileMaker to realize that the network connection is not there anymore. And there it is. FileMaker Pro now knows that we are no longer connected to the network, but we have the option to reconnect. So let's first reestablish my network connection and let's reconnect to FileMaker Server. All right, so our session is still intact. I can navigate through the records, but what happened is that my script got aborted. So the fact that your Farmica script will get interrupted when a network disconnect happens is something that you have to keep in mind. There are ways to mitigate that, for instance, by using the transactional model when you create new records so that you will have no stray records or bad data in your file. But to summarize, this much improved network resilience is a huge feature in FileMaker 14. And obviously it is tied into the other feature that is a very specific FileMaker server feature, the primary to standby cutover and failover. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to Solign TV to view more videos from the unboxing FileMaker 14 series.